going on guys and welcome back to some more Super Mario RPG in the last part we did none other than uh made it to Booster Tower and, and if you're wondering why we're in Moleville I just bought some armor for Bowser since he joined our team so uh yeah wait a minute I can just go straight to Booster Tower I don't know it's not that far a distance I should say but uh we're going to Booster Tower so now that Bowser opened the way we can basically go into Booster Tower so um yeah I guess I can kind of show off Bowser's battle mechanics really here. Hello there, Booster's bigger now so you can't play. So, come back and try to force your way in and we have to fight this guy. So, uh, yeah, so I guess we can find a, uh, Bowser is mo mostly an offensive tank, let's just say. Um, he's mostly offense, let's say. He, he's not very good special. He has a decent amount of HP, but, uh, he's not very good in terms of, like, he's mostly a physical wall, let's just say. He basically just starts off with a claw attack. So, uh, yeah, Bowser can be probably your strongest party member at this point in the game, let's just say. Also, new enemy. Also, one thing you can do is that, like, you can sw swap out party members in between battles. You could not do this in the original. So, uh, yeah, I like how they added this in the remake. So, yeah, it looks like these snippets are weak to ice and, uh, we don't have any ice moves yet, though. Yeah, Bowser's already doing 100 damage. He's unarmed. So, uh, to be fair, we gave him the work pants, so he's turned into a scarecrow. So, uh, we're gonna let Mallow, uh, let Mallow thought peek him. Yeah, looks like he's weak to fire. So, uh, I actually never knew that about the, these guys. So, let's just throw down a fireball. A 230 damage. Anyway, so I guess we can swap from Mallow back to Gino. Um, I like using Mallow, but I like using Gino more, let's just say. Remember these pictures orders, by the way. Hidden treasure nearby. Fortunately, I know where it is. What's the big rush? Booster, and this is my famous tower of amusement. Normally, I welcome visitors to play with me and my sniffsters. However, a girl fell out of the sky and it's in my lap recently. Since then, I've been busy keeping her happy and entertained. I no longer have time to play, so please enjoy yourself at your own risk, that is. Anyways, so we have to go along the train. Could make a fucking Colleen Ballinger reference, but that's so last year. Let's just say a new enemy, by the way. We're gonna swap out. We're gonna swap back over Malice. We kind of thought peek him, but um. Yeah, looks like they're weak to both jump and fire. So let's just uh, let's throw on a fireball. It's a bob bomb, so it makes sense they're weak to fire. I guess we can switch from Mallow back to Gino. I guess that's really uh, all the enemies we can do here. So, uh, if you go over here, by the way, just make sure you time your jump right. And I got that first try, but uh, if, you, if you jump, you, you get a masher, which is uh, definitely the best weapon Mario can equip at this point in the game, because look at how much it raises your attack. The punch glove goes from 93 attack, the masher goes to 113, so... Yeah, I would recommend picking this up. Even if you have to backtrack throughout the uh, booster tower again. So, uh... I guess I could have cut there, but uh, it doesn't take really long to backtrack program. I would have cut out failed attempts to get that masher, though. Anyway, so that was a battle I had to uh, cut out. Anyway, so, uh... We just have, we're gonna have to follow where Booster went. He went this way. If we go this way, what was that loud noise out there? Check, check out Booster Palace. We're gonna have to do that later. However, this is the, actually this is the area where you can uh yeah we can turn into 8-bit Mario. I love how this remake also came out the same year the Super Mario Brothers movie came out. Uh, at least the recent one did. Um, however, if we touch any of the doors. Also, 
also, we can only do that once, unfortunately. So, uh, yeah, it's a nice little Easter egg they throw in there. Oh, new enemies. These are new enemies. <laughs> but, again, let's use Mallow to Thought Peak. Um, blasters are going to be weak to... Lightning Fear. So, yeah, it's, I guess it's going to use Mallow this fight. Look at how much damage that masher did. Um, yeah, the masher already took out the... Uh, if I can get the weakness out the thunder and all that, let's play it on a thunderbolt. Yeah, that was clearly a weakness right there. Okay, so... Let's see. Well, good news. And level up. I want to fight this damn Sniffit, but uh, Mario's level 9, and uh, of course, we're going to get our attack up. Can we dock this damn Sniffit? More level up. Anyway, so uh, Mal's level 9, of course, we're going to do a magic attack, and uh, Bowser is level 9. So uh, we're gonna increase more. We're gonna go more offense on Bowser. We want Bowser to be a physical tank. Okay. All right. Finally, I talked to this lap. The sniff of Jesus. I got into legit six battles right there. So uh, freaking ridiculous. Let's just say I got six battles. Let's uh, thought peek them. I don't have enough FP, so it's time to use a honey syrup. Another one. Your FP back up. We have freebie. That's awesome. And finally, let's thought peek him. Let's see what he's weak to. He's weak to ice fire. Yeah, we don't have any ice attacks though. There's very little of them in this game, to be honest. I just lost my gosh streak. Gino's also also a level up. So uh. Boy, I think there's one more new enemy we can fight in this area. There's a save block, but, um... Alright, so let's see if I can remember this order. So, uh, boost the first. Oh, new enemy! This is the Orb user. Uh, they have high amounts of defense. I want to find out what they're weak against, though, and I couldn't. Yeah, they basically have low HP, but high defense. I guess I don't even need to cut out this, but that battle, but, uh, Gino's also a level up, but, uh, yeah, I don't always remember the order. I think it's this, 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 and this. I guess when I can instant kill the uh, war music, I can just keep trying to like get it. One, two, three. Yeah, that's it. And we get the elder key. If we use that here, I would recommend getting this weapon also. To gaze into each other's eyes. Mario, she's a bit shy. Look the other way, will you? You can turn around now. She says she's been locked up since she took a bite out of booster, so now she wants to help us stir a little trouble. Mwahaha. And we got Chomp. We got Chain Chomp. So, uh, I guess we can equip Bowser with that. So, uh, it goes from, or, again, his attack goes from 100 to 110. So, I wouldn't recommend getting this weapon. And we have to, um, I think there's a, yeah, there's a frog, there's a mushroom right here. Could have sworn that was a frog coin, but, uh, gonna move. Okay. Oh, by the way, new enemies, frog coin, 
Let's see if we can hop, because if you trigger a, a dangerous spot, like, um... Surprise, I'm gone. Oh, yeah, they, these are it. These are the, uh... These are the lava bubbles. They're like the ones in, uh... There's, they're like the ones in the sewers, except stronger. And they can use attacks like, uh, static, you know, like, light, like, uh... They can use basic new moves before the game. Jammer's level 9, so, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna get his attack up. And honestly, I think I'm gonna switch my whole part. I think I'm gonna switch from Malagino. Just gotta write Yoshi. Yeah, they can also give, like, lucky orbs and all that. And we get the zoom shoes, which makes one of our characters go faster. Who should I to Mario? Gino's already pretty fast as it is, so, uh... Actually, should I? I'm thinking of giving it to Bowser, but, um... Yeah, I think Mario can use the Zoom Shoes. Anyway, new enemies! These are the Chain Chomps. I guess I have to switch back to Mallow so I can, uh... I can kind of thought peek them. Looks like they're weak to lightning, fear, poison, and all that. So, uh... They're also weak to mashers, though. Bowser uses the chain shot. If you time it right, it can do a little, a little bit of damage like that. It can do additional damage, let's say, because we have a weapon on Bowser, finally. I love how I can give basic things, like, at times when sometimes my commentary just isn't really that good, but I don't know. Um... Chugga chug chugga. Good chugga chugga honk. That's my personal rare way. Yeah. Hi, it's you again. I'm amazed you made it this far. Yes, I'm quite amazing you are. Since you're here, maybe you can clear up something for me. My bride to be is chanting, Mario help me, Mario help me, Mario help me. She's showing her happiness. Wait a second, maybe Mario is another guy. Well, if you're this Mario she keeps talking about, try to take my bride away, won't you take this instead? And if we just leave. He's gone! That's not fair. I'm so hard while I play with him now, it was from like this. Now I remember I should look like this. You can also wait behind the portrait and wait for the bob bombs to explode, but um let's switch from Malagino. I'm only gonna switch to Mallow for like Thought Peak. So I know there's a hit I there's a hidden treasure, but I wanna get this right here. Yeah, we got a frog coin. That's where I thought the frog coin was. And look! Notice this doll right here? Samus. Here. Mario, you did come to the rescue me. I was so frightened and lonely. But now that you're here. The door won't open. I think we need boost this spell to undo the lock on it. What what should we do? Aha! What should we do? Booster's returning, isn't he? I know, hide somewhere and wait until he opens the door. Move freely behind the curtains. Good luck hiding from Booster and his snifters. If they catch you, you have to battle Booster. Just be careful on that. You don't want to get caught because you get an item that you cannot get if you get caught. Boss, should we concentrate on the girl? Right. Now about the girl in my life. Who thinks I should marry her? Well, speak up. A wedding ceremony would make a great party. Ah, party. We haven't had one of those. It could be fun. So what is a party? Well, you drink punch and eat cake, I think. Drink punch and eat cake? Sounds complicated. I don't know if I can must see anything to do it. Let's walk through it once. The wedding rehearsal time. We will now be in the ceremony. We don't have to hang out with, hey, someone make her smile, beautiful bride-to-be. Wait, Mario always shows up now to ruin the fun. We've got to take that into consideration, you know. Someone go get the Mario doll. It isn't here. Oh, of course it's here, you lazy slobs. Couldn't find water if you were fish. Behind those curtains. Number one, you go look and look. So we have to avoid the snippets. If you know where the snippets are gonna go, you also know you also can just do whatever do this every time. 
it's always the same. Like, uh, he's gonna check the, uh, you guys gonna check those ones. Basically, when he gets closer to you, you wanna flee. Nope, nothing here. I wouldn't go and lose my Mario doll, you idiots. All right, number two, you look too. So with two sniffers in are playing this. I apologize for that, by the way. And uh, yeah, two snippets are in. Yeah, sometimes the sniffers try to trick you right there. Doesn't see, I don't see anything. We can't get up, it's gotta be here somewhere. Number three, it's your turn. So yeah, three sniffets now. And make sure with this last one, hide right here. Wait a minute. This is better than a party, because here I come. Wait a second, it's right up there. I found the Mario doll. We'll never really reach up there, all the sorrow. What am I gonna do? to lose it, Sniffle. Goodness, you're so kind. Thank you for getting my doll. I'd like to award you. Here, take this. We have the Booster's Charm. It was called the Amulet in the original version. My happiness follow you wherever you go. Alright, enough is enough. Cancel the rehearsal. We're going on with the show. Here's the password. Bear. Now, interesting thing about this. In the Super Nintendo version, the password was whatever you named your save file. In this case, it's whatever you named your Switch account. And boss time. Wait. You took all the trouble to come here. Just so stick around. So yeah, we're gonna G my strat is I wanna Geno boost Mario. We're definitely gonna Geno boost Mario. I'm gonna try to see if I can super jump knife guy. He seems to be the one that's more vulnerable to super jump. Get the attack scarf now. Yeah, that was the first time I hit. Th I broke 30 super gems, so uh, I think knife guy should also be almost down. He's a Geno boost. I'm Bowser. Two hundred fifty-four damage. Yeah, th these guys are kind of. Let's just say if you can do super jump really well, like if you do it the right way, you can basically do it a pretty. Bro it's pretty broken. Let's just say. Two hundred sixteen, and Bowser is going to hit, do two hundred twenty-eight. That was nice guy and great guy. We got a flower jar in that confusion.
please, let me go, won't you please? Pretty please? Eh, where's my bride to be? I wanna play hide and seek too. Yuck, I wanna play anything with you. What a poor sport, we should really should hurry along. A yummy cake is waiting for us, I'm gonna climb this hill. Let's go. No, I don't wanna marry you, please let me go. Help Mario, please help me. Uh oh, it's Mario, we didn't plan this. Oh, you aren't invited to our wedding. Besides, you still don't have the rehearsal. I'll be happy to race you to the wedding hall, but you better not knock out my way. Ready? This is the Booster Hill track. Need some advice? Yes. You can only move left to right and jump, and you can't go forward or backwards. Touch the snifters or any of the barrels, you'll fall back. Jump on the barrels of sniffer to sprint forward. Reach out and touch for the fiction and win flowers. Ready, set, go. Alright, so I'd suggest using the D-pad for this portion, to be honest, if you have a Switch Pro controller. I do. If you time it just right, you'll get flowers. Like, if you do, if you're, I'm not always good at this particular minigame, but like, if you can time your jumps just right, you'll, you can get a lot of flowers, let's just say. We got ahead of the snifters and uh, there's flowers. I just juice forward. I'm actually doing really good so far. I shouldn't jinx that. That's another flower. We're getting a lot of flowers so far. I'm not always good at this minigame. I can get anywhere between four flowers or sometimes nine. I think the most amount I've gotten is nine. I think if you get on the, I think the red ones were added to the remake. If you land on those, you go even faster. Go even farther, I meant. The flower. The one. Yeah, when it gets really hectic, yeah, I kind of concentrate. I gotta kind of concentrate. I don't think I'm gonna get any more flowers. You never know, but um. Yeah, that's we're not getting any more flowers, and we got we got it quite a bit actually. We got um, we got nine flowers. That's my personal best. And now we're in Marymore, so um, let's use our flower jar, and uh, we already have fifty flower points, which is a lot for this part of the game. So uh. Yeah, I'm going to cut it off for this part of Sumar RPG. So next time on Sumar RPG, we're going to explore more of Mary Moore. See you guys then.